Hey, what's up guys? It is Azophobia here, and today I'm going to be doing something different. I'm probably going to be doing like a, well not probably, I am going to be doing a story, and um, I don't really know why I'm doing a story. I have no motivation whatsoever. I'm just bored and have nothing else to do and haven't, wrote, haven't put anything on the channel in like months. So uh, what I'm going to be talking about today is... Uh, the time I dated a uh, a girl who is now considered a man, which I didn't find out until like three years later after I dated her, but it started in like fifth grade when I met this girl, um, I'm not going to use her as actual name, so I'm going to say something like Annie, her name was Annie, and at I think it was the second to last day of school in fifth grade, and I heard I heard her in the lunchroom talking to a friend saying that she liked me, and I approached her about I was like, so you like me or whatever, and then we started dating. Like I never actually officially asked her out. It, it was fifth grade, so there was nothing really about it. So that whole entire summer, we didn't talk to each other once. We didn't. I have any communication with her. I gave her my phone number, but, you know, I didn't pick up the phone ever. And the next year came by, I saw her, she gave me a big hug, because I guess we were still dating. And l let me just get this out there now. She was a pretty strange girl. Like, she wasn't really normal. Like, she wore, like, dog collars and stuff, and it was kind of freaky. And, um... Sixth grade, I saw her. She gave me a big hug, and I think it was like three months later. She was like, "Hey, we can't, we can't date anymore." And I'm like, "Oh, okay." It, it was nice, and then that was that. And um, so years kind of just went by, and like I was aware of her existence, like, but it was like really wasn't that big of a deal. And then the next year came around, um, seventh grade. And we became really good friends, actually. And um, it went to, like, eighth grade, and then we totally just, like, stopped talking to each other. I don't know why. I'm pretty sure it's because, like, I started hanging with a different group of friends, and she was just, went straight up just, like, weeaboo. It was, it was ridiculous. Like, she went, like, Sugoi Desu Chan type shit, and, like, New Japanese and everything. It was insane. But, um... Anyways, after eighth grade went on, I um I was in class one day, and Facebook is kind of dead right now, like, for at least our age group. It's like Instagram, Snapchat, and that type of shit. And I went on, I went on Facebook, because I was really bored to go look at all my uh, old pictures of myself, I, like, with... When I was full Minecraft loser and shit, it was weird. I had, like, Minecraft pixel art in the background of my Facebook with old pictures of me. And so I was just looking at suggested friends and looking at how young all my friends look at the time. Before, um, before you know, like, now, where they look older is and because we're all, like, 15, 16 years old. And, and I was looking... And I've seen a couple of people that I haven't seen in a while, I haven't talked to them. And they were still using Facebook, which I found kind of weird, but that was besides the point. So, and then I find a picture. I knew it was her, but I was so confused because I was like, I was like, hey, is that Annie? So I clicked on it. I looked at the photo. I was like, yeah, it's definitely her. And then I looked at the name. And I shit you not, I'm not gonna, I'm, I'm gonna change the name, obviously. I shit you not, I looked at her Facebook, and she switched her name to William. Buzz cut her hair off. It was, it was terrifying. Like, I was like, that's who I dated? Are you serious? And it was, it was a William, and I'm like... I was like, maybe this is just a brother's account, and she's their profile picture, 
and then I looked at her post. It was like all weeb stuff, and I knew it was, I knew it was her because she's the only one that speaks Japanese and posts a bunch of anime shit randomly. And I so I went to school the next day, and then I told my friend John, just not his actual name. I told my friend John, I was like, "Hey, did you know Annie um, is a is a guy now?" And and he's like, yeah, I knew that. And apparently a shitload of people knew about this this supposed gender switch, which was really freaking me out. And, but, like, actually, like, last, not even last year, like, during the summer, I saw her. And I called her name. She responded. And she still had the her hair cut really short, and I called her name, and she responded with her her normal name, which I guess surprised me. And she was with a guy, and I don't know if they were dating or not. I don't know. It was kind of weird, kind of freaky or whatever. But yeah, that's that's all I gotta say. Uh, like, subscribe if you enjoyed the story time. Uh, and I will talk to you guys later. Peace. Yo, DJ, put a nigga back to the record, baby, and give me this right now.